Hi, how are we doing? Nick from Beardineers here. And next up, we have got a can of Battle Swans. A double IPA from Asvex, coming in at 8.5%. And it is brewed with Citra, Strata and Motueka. So I love all those hops. I bought this from the Asvex website with a you know order of other beers as well. I think it costs sort of five pound in a multi in a multi pack, um, which is bloody good these days. Um, so I haven't had a bad B yet from Asvex. Probably my you know best discovery brewery of, of the year. I'd say without devs. Um, let's see what it's like. I hope it's good. Better be because I bought four of these bitches. Um, I have. Little there to be honest. Ooh, get a aroma of that. Let's get into a glass and see what we got. Oh, 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 oh. oh that is a, a cheering sight. So that is an extreme haze bomb, luminous yellow, straw coloured beer with nearly a finger of ivory whitehead that looks that looks beautiful let's get the nose so i'm getting i can, I can get i'm getting the citra i'm getting the the white grapefruit bit of pink grapefruit Maybe a little bit of earthiness in there as well. So, sort of like a, there's like an off, overripe fruit, overripe tropical fruit aroma. And a bit of dank earthiness in there as well. Yeah. It's all, so that uh, that dank earthiness, it's, it's sort of like borderline almost, you know, too much. Bordering and unpleasant, but I, I'm just growing to, That smells great. Let's dive in. Chin chin. Oh. <laughs> That's beautiful. I'm so glad I bought four. So up front it's white grapefruit, it's pink grapefruit. Coming through then is a bit of tropical. Then it goes to like a dank earthiness, then to hot bitterness. And throughout that, there's this undercurrent of sweetness, which is just, just right. It's not too much. It's just enough to make it really sort of, oh, mouth-wateringly delicious. Mm. Body is medium, carbonation is very light, yeah. So it's a bit of a contrast to the polys I had earlier. Oh, that is, <coughs> excuse me. Oh, look at that. Look at that beer. It tastes exactly what it looks like. Just a juicy, tropical, Citrus, bitter, sweet, dank, hot bomb. Fantastic. Um, so, Battle Swans. So glad I got four of these. Oh, good decision. Coming in at 8.5%. The alcohol is well hidden. Although, give it a 30 seconds or so and I might... No, I'm not feeling any alcohol at all. So the alcohol is really well hidden. Uh, Quaffability. Um, I think because it, it, it gets medium bodied, the sweetness is 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 is, is medium. Uh, I would say it's medium quaffability. Uh, for me, I could, you know, I could really smash this. It's absolutely beautiful. It's just so nice. Um, but how much of it you could get through it, I don't know. But it, I would say it's medium quaffability. I'd, I'd have a bloody good go. I can tell you that much. Mm. 
that is fantastic. So, Battle Swans, 8.5% double IPA from Asvex over in Liverpool. Um, brewed with Citrus Strata Motoweka. I like that enough to give it uh, an outstanding 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 for Battle Swans. Well done, Adam and co. Over up in Liverpool. You smashed it again. So I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to go and enjoy this. And then there's been a, been a bit of a, you know, sort of a, a bittersweet day today. So the daughter firm, we dropped her off at uni. Um, so, you know, what's the cure for emptiness syndrome? Could it be the double IPA of the year for me? Fruit car size exhibition? Probably not, no. That's probably not going to be an antidote to it, but do you know what? I'm going to give it a bloody good go. Thanks for watching. Um, put a thumbs if you like the video, thumbs down if you don't. Thanks. Uh, put a comment if you've had that, uh, the, the Battle Swans beer. Thanks. Bye for now. Cheers.